Hi and welcome to the women's competition held back in April. I'm Chris and I'm with Josh Roberto. Uh, we're currently commentating on Team Woo versus Team Woohoo. And we're just getting into the coverage right now. Jody Harrison has the ball here. Uh, takes the ball. We have Ashley Harrison trying to look for a pass, working out the strategy here. Just Shan's on to that. Nice run through Shan. Oh, back with the block. Some strong D there. Oh, sneaky holding of the of the stick there by Beck. Not seen by referee Matt Hudson. Although, Chris, that's a smart strategy there. A little bit of sucking out early on. Uh, unfortunately, not a good pass there. Uh, it depends who she was passing to. She was passing to the red team. That was a great pass. Oh, no. Oh, Nanka just couldn't get that last ball. Beck back with the ball. Plenty of action from Beck to start the game up. It's team Woohoo looking for some play. Elizabeth Tilly picks up the ball. Hoping to find someone to start off this counter attack. Nice soft pass too. Was that Sarah? That was Ashlyn. That was Ashlyn. Get this together, Chris. <laughs> Sorry, Sarah and Ashlyn. Shan with a nice flick. Goes straight over the top of Dominic. The wrist are there to cover. It's a nice block. Team Woot resets back. Dominic looking for a nice pass. Goes with the flick. Straight over the line. And good reset to Shan who gets it over the line again. Hell yeah pushes through. That's a crab walking. It's a nice strategy by that goalie. <laughs> you, you always want a goalie that's a little bit urgent on, on that ball. Plays down the corner, guys. Joe finds some. Oh, nice unlucky. Oh, it was a good flick um, if it was going Ryan to... Ryan has a shot. Oh, oh, nice save. Team Woot looks at reset. Down the corner. Harrison picks it up. Looks for someone. Looks holding, again. Holding. Holding. Ah, and held too long. It's Dominique with the breakout. She's got Jody beside her. It's unlucky. Beck with some good. Beck, Brian with some good defense there. And Jody taking control of the ball for her team. Alright, it's a nice cross shot here. Someone could pick this up. This would be a good play. I think it's going to go over the line first, and it's over. Unfortunately, that's icing. I think the pass was originally to Monique and just pushed that a little bit too far ahead of her. As we go through the team list, we have Team Woot, we have Anka, we have Shan, we have Ashlyn, we have Beck, Shan, we have Chelsea, Elizabeth, and Louise. I think you actually skipped Sarah's name there, Josh. <laughs> not perfect, not perfect. Let's hope these refs are as perfect as what the team lists are. Perfect timing for Brenton to go. What's going on? Ref drops the ice. Good win by Joe. Anka's not letting it go oh, down. Oh, with the trip, sir. What's going on? That's the Jubus call there by the ref. Yeah, he really needs to put his eyes back on. Joe's with the ball. Try wants to take advantage of this play. Just can't get it for oh nice, nice flick little over flick. the top. Nice little flick. Some good attack there. The ends on this, oh, unfortunately, it just takes a fall. But not giving up on that ball. Still there, still in the still in the zone. Really looking for someone. Oh, oh straight no. past. Nice turn there. It's a nice save by, by Jared Ferrara. Joe with the run Joe's through. Joe's away. Joe versus Anka, who will win the race? Apparently Beck. It's a nice push through Beck. Gets it deep for her team. Resets the play. And Ferrara has to play at it. Uncle with the pass out. Who's that with the ball? Jan going around the back. Beck pushing her all the way. Beck wins that competition. Mark with a nice save there. Passes off to Brown. Brown works through. Looking for a cross shot here. Oh, Beck cops one in the face, I think, there. Refs, yeah, the back play ref, he really needs to take advantage of those calls and make sure he's up alive for him. This could get out of hand real quick. And a reset back to Shan, who seems to be doing a lot of feeding of the ball from that back position. 
Although, yeah, her form on Dirt Squirrel shows that she can handle this responsibility, so we look forward to how it goes from here. I like the line of defense, they're not too closely packed, but they're, they're not giving them an out either. It resets down. Team, team Woot looking, trying. Yeah, Team Woot, I got it right. Team Woot, look, damn it, I got it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a nice flick, oh, good work by Shan there. Anybody thinks she plays softball? Cat works it in, oh, it's a nice block. Really taking the responsibility to move this team around. So it's Tilly on, can't quite see who's got it from. It's Dominique there, Dominique. nice push down into the deep corner by Dominique there. That's Ashlyn, gets it away again. Nice pass to Sarah. Chan's open. Oh, and Dominique with the win on that exchange. These two have been matched up pretty early off and it looks like it's gonna be a tough tussle between these two. Sarah looking for someone. And it's Shan with the ball. With the clearance. Yep, One. just past Jody. It's a good push down forward. Is he gonna make it to the line? Settles. No. Jody with a good clear. Sets it up. Monique gets a pass. Monique gets it over? Monique got it over. Ref call. Over again. Uh, now foot race between Larissa and... Yeah, Larissa gets the ball. Has that ball, ball in that corner, works it around. Uh, is that Larissa or is that Joe? No, that is Larissa. You can see by that running motion that it is Larissa. <laughs> she does like to sit into the run, a bit of bit of rowing to help her along. Yeah, there'll be the general push. Jody with the shot. Oh. oh, back with the clean. It's a nice pick up there. Nice second attempt. Dominique holds it, shoots. Oh, oh good save. You'd think the um, the goalies are almost the same person out there. Well, it's been a clean sheet so far. Some good defense by these goalies. Larissa sets it up. It's a nice clear in the middle. Passes it back to Harrison. Harrison with a nice pass over to Langham. It's a good Larissa with the ball here. Oh, unfortunately, no one pick it up in the middle. Jody staying back to keep control. Plenty of distance, plenty of space. Works into the middle. She has had found some success with her local club with this shot. A nice pass to Dominique there. Oh, a nice push out from Mark Ferrara. More desperation from our goalies. A little bit of clearance there. Beck looks open. Is he going to get back to Beck? It is going back to Beck. Team Woohoo building the pressure here, guys. And again, Jody goes for a run across the ice. Just giving Team Wood a little bit of time to reset, guys. Dominique with the ball. Chelsea with some good defense to hold it, to keep her wide at this time. Dominique with a nice pass in the center. Finds Langham. She holds out that ball nice. Nice pass to Harrison. Harrison shoots. Oh, nearly by Monique. Harrison with the ball, tries to look for a pass, quick pass out to Helia. It's in the center, could be a shot here. Uh, just left a little bit behind, got behind a stick and just wasn't able to get the speed on it. A little bit of tussle between the Druids B players here. come together. Ooh. There's no love loss in, this, in these women's games. Nice pass. Oh, look for a nice pass oh. by Harrison there. Beck's trying to work it around. It's a good cross by Brian. To Chelsea. What's Chelsea going to do with it? Oh, Kicks it away. Send, nice. them with the pass. send them with the foot pass. The sock is really paying off from those Wednesday nights. Straight through. Is it too fast though? I think she's pushed it too hard, Josh. She has. I think that's a nice and call. But zero all halfway through this half. How do you think it's going, Hookins? I think it's nice and tight. I mean, I'm really impressed by some of the girls who haven't played a lot of women's comp before. Mm. Um, I think Monique's a, a bit of a standout. She's gotten the ball over the line every time she's touched it. I do agree with that, Colin. Um, it looks it looks evenly tussled at the moment. Yeah. Just waiting for this ref to, to get this play started again. Anka just 
people in the face off just directing their players and making sure everyone's good. And it's away. Oh, Brown with a nice push there. It almost seemed illegal. A little bit of trouble trying to clear this ball. Oh, that looks Ooh, like... that's on the oh. line. That's on the line. Oh, it's been called up. That was, that was on the line, Josh. And just to remind our fans, on the line is onside. So that was offside. Uh, if we look back on this replay, it just really didn't look like an offside call. We don't like to bag out our refs here, but they really should have their glasses on. Uh, Hudson with the face off. Nice push over. Will yes. Um, with the end of the win. Choosing what to do with it. Nice push through to Jody. Oh, Joe with the interception. Joe gets a pass, Brand. It's Sarah and Joe now. Will Sarah be able to get around the front? And no. Oh, nice Joe shot. Joe for the goal. That's a good shot by Joe. Sorry, Mark. You didn't get on that one, though, mate. So what do you think, Josh? you think there's going to be more in the game, or do you think Joe's pushed them far enough ahead to win it? That play seems like Joe's kind of taken it on her own, own initiative to get something started, and hopefully we get a little bit more attacking play from this team. Nice flick over again. Oh, it's a good pass there. Larissa um, with the push through, using her speed there. Plenty of attacking from um, our yellow team. It's a nice pass. Good pass to Leanne. She's working on the ball. Working in that right corner. Holding it up, trying to get some trying to get an option. Trying to find a good option here. Unfortunately couldn't find one. Nice defense from how we are. Oh it stops. Uh, Larissa again. Larissa does not want to have to run back into her own half. It's a good clear in the corner, making this making this team work, really work hard for their attacking play. And then we have our illustrious leader just running into the play, distracting we this women's game. Do we call that as a streaker? I don't know, but it's distracted it's distracted Sarah enough to put it out of play. So we just have a delay with the face-off coming through now. Six minutes to go, it's 1-0 to Team Woohoo. Who's on the camera? It's very dizzying. A little bit of instruction by the uh, the ref Brentons, yeah. A little bit of a strategy change. Oh, oh, nearly. I'm really impressed by our goalies. They're not natural goalies, they're forwards, so they're not even um, natural necessarily defenders. Um, but they're both doing really strong in, in goals despite the, the obvious 1 nil advantage. I'm quite impressed by the, the Ferrara lads in goals. Oh, and a little bit of a delay on that shot by Jody. A little bit of a slow motion. We didn't even have to put that on instant replay on that one. <laughs> a little bit of a delay trying to get this ball out. Is it me or is it Beck playing the body a fair bit in this game? I don't know. It seems there's a couple of dubious calls that the refs could have picked up, but I think they lay in play settle down a bit and let these let the women decide who's going to score oh I don't think there's anything in it but a bit of rubbing of elbows never hurt anyone until it does nice pass oh unfortunately not a strong pass in the middle Shan clears it out uncle with the stumble you don't need to slide to get the ball as proven there by Anka one of the few times that she does again Shan with the ball to reset for the team Sham with a nice pass to Anka. Chemistry is working well. Oh, good, good push down into the corner. Larissa with the run. Anka gets to that ball. And the pretty slide to a stop from Larissa. There's a flick pass in. Shan, oh, and unfortunately just blocked by Jared there. Another shot in. Oh, and Jared again off the, the block. shoulder. Jared's using his whole body. Saxon, get out of that shot, mate. Jared really put in there. 
He's really putting his body on the line to stop, keep the clean sheet. Unfortunately, couldn't let that one from Jody go through. Right, Jody was not happy with the bounce offer. And Shan resets again. Nice pass at the middle. She seems to be really good as we hold for the op delayed offside there. It's a nice work up by Cat. Joe get Joe works to get to that through ball. A little bit of space. Through. A little bit of space here. Oh, holds it up. Pro probably could have taken that shot. Left that second too long, Josh. Just waited for Beck to get a little just, bit deeper in goals. Just unfortunate. We just couldn't find that last connecting pass. Just trying to find a good option. Goes back to JD. JD with the pass through, but nobody on the end. Apart from... I think it was Chelsea with the, the intercept there. Yeah, it was, actually. She played some really good defense at the moment, so... We look forward to see if that carries on. Oh, oh, Mark with a save. And again off the post. He refuses to go down another goal. Sibling, oh, that sibling rivalry is really kicking in. Oh, That was a bit high. I understand that she's not the tallest player out there, but it's still well above shoulders, Josh. It's a nice block there. And Shan again. Shan Brown again. She seems to be everywhere at the moment, Chris. Are we thinking about maybe moving Shan to D for the squirrels? Not too sure at the moment. We'll probably have to check with our captain and see what strategy we're going to work with in this next couple of weeks. How are you with the ball? Looking for a nice option. Finds Ashlyn Harrison. Uh, I think Ashlyn tried to throw it back through to her, but Joe got in the way. Beck with a nice clear into the corner. Joe Hansen works back. Has Chelsea there. Works away. Leanne's moving forward There's to give her nice, it out as well. Yep, nice straight four to check. Leanne. Nice forecheck by these ladies. I think Jody might be a little bit high there. Oh, uh, she's gone for the break. Is it through? Yeah, it is. Through. Oh, Beck clearing it. Louise is on the ball, looking for a pass. Gets a nice pass to Sarah. Sarah gets it back in. Oh, this could be a goal scoring. Unfortunately, no. It works out to the side. Chelsea trying to reset for her team. Just quickly, let's run through the Team Woohoo side. We have Joanne Hanson, Jody Harrison, Larissa Moore, Rebecca Langham, Dominic Glazier, Leanne Ermish, Monique, and I believe Kat's in that team as well, Kat McDonald. We just had a part shot from Sarah. And Chelsea just unfortunately couldn't get enough stick on the ball to get it back into the centre. We have Hanson working it through. Hanson's got pace to burn even at this late stage in the game. So we get closer to the end of this this half. Uh, it's only one half, isn't it, Josh? No, it's full game. Uh, full game. As I've been told by Mr. Hooper, that it is a full game. Unfortunately, not enough. Oh, uh, Chelsea's off. away. Chelsea have Did to break. Did you see that tripping attempt by Jody? Just should have been sent front sportsman, I think. Oh, Chelsea with the shot on target. Just couldn't get enough on it to get it past Jared. And Saxon again doing his thing, being happy in knowing that he's supporting this sport down in New South Wales, in Western Sydney. It's a nice pick up. Pick up by Team Woohoo. Jody off, unfortunately offside just a bit there. Team Referee Hudson calls it up. It's a nice call. Hanson with the ball. Looks, Looks at the clock. Really trying to suss out the last player this half. Just Ashton through. Trying to find a nice clear. Just reset that ball. Ashlyn Harrison wants none of this. No no more. No Monique's more ball movement in this half. Monique's all over her. And that, that seems to be it for the first half, Chris. Yeah, 1-0. Oh, we do have a second half. My bad. Sorry, sorry. Quick start to this second half. And Team Woohoo wins it. So we just go through the goal scorer and Joe Hansen with a nice shot pass through Mark Ferrara for the first goal of the game. It's 1-0 at the moment. Again, Shan clearing it into the open half for Unko uh, running through at full speed with the pass away. But the pass goes to no one, unfortunately. It's still in that corner. It's still an advantageous position for him. Dominique with a nice turn. She's trying to work it through that middle. Off really the pushing the speed. Oh, it's a nice pass through the middle. It's really pushing Team Woot back. 
they're really feeling the pressure again. Oh, the wrister again with the run. I think it's been called icing. It has been called icing. What do you think of that running technique that Larissa was employing there? I think it's unique. Um, and I love the stopping, how she either slides majestically or folds over to come to an end. It's a different strategy. It's just unfortunately didn't work for her at that time. So we go back down to an icing in their defensive zone. Do we think it was an action, actual icing or do we think Matt Hudson is just feeling tired? I think it was an actual icing now. Yeah, I think it was a good call by the referee. Are we going to get a face-off? We may do, eventually. <laughs> just to point out the goal... Hellier and Glacier mashed up again. Just to point out the goalies do stay in their respective goals. There's no one goalie for both ends. Um, that switch for the teams, the goalies actually stay put. It's a nice pass in the middle. This cameraman is not focusing well. What are we paying? I don't think you pay him anything, Josh. Yeah, we should probably think about that. Maybe maybe pepperoni pizza would be nice. Oh, Sh Sham with the nice pass through. Oh, and Jody shut that down. Marissa trying to get it into the center. Unfortunately, it goes back. Lewitt, Le Leanne nice clear. Back. Nice clear by the goalie, Leanne, who's out on the ice tonight. Good pass through to Dominic Glacier there. She looks up, works towards the center. Takes a shot, and Shan's feet get in the way. He has the ball again. Oh, unfortunately, Helly is there to block. Larissa in the post. Jared with a nice save. Works out to the corner. It's a nice pass by Ashland over to the other side to get some space for Brown. Brown thinks about oh, she, switching there. Oh, she does eventually, and it was nicely timed. Oh, but Jody again. Jody just seems to be there when they need her to be. Unfortunately, couldn't get that ball. Helly, a nice pass to Senden. That said, Jody did get a nice whack on shins, but I think that's against the rules, Josh. I don't know. As we look here, Sarah unfortunately couldn't get that shot in the middle, but does get the does get the first attempt at it. It's working in that corner, tries to work it in the middle for someone for a shot. Does work out. Works out to Brown at the moment. A nice shot by Brown. Unfortunately, not enough action on that post, but they are working hard on that post, Chris. Yeah, it's a very, very close game, Josh. I, I, I know that obviously Joe took it by the scruff of the neck earlier and scored that goal, but I don't know which team's actually outplaying the other side. Seems to be evenly matched, even 1-0. Oh, nice. Uh, in. Oh, nice pick up. It's nice to have that second goalie on the ice to protect Mark. He's down, down one goal, but he's fighting valiantly. Oh, nice block again by Leanne. The goalie experience is showing in force. And Beck again using the body to try and get to that ball. Oh, that's what played off for this time. And the flick through. Really pushing oh, through. Beck is really pushing through. Jo to Jody. Jody in the middle. Jody with the breakaway here, guys. This could be a goal scoring opportunity. Unfortunately, oh, off the post. Ding, the sound that a goalie loves to hear the most. The ding oh. of metal. Ferrara is very relieved that that hit the post and went to the side instead of in. It's really working hard for that clean sheet. Hellia passes it back to Brian. Back to Hellia. Back to Brian. Pressure, pressure from Team Woohoo on this four check seems to be good. Team Woo having trouble to get it back out into her attacking zone. Nice clearance into Brenton's legs. Sets up for Joe. Joe with a block shot there. Comes out back over to halfway. Jilly's racing for that one. Really working hard for oh, that ball. Joe from nowhere. Nice, nice urgency to get back and help the team out. Oh, Beck's away. Oh, oh that looked awful. That looks bad. Is she getting up? She does not look too good. She is taking a moment there. And I think we got we'll take a moment. As we get, have a bit of a break in the action. Accidents happen, but you hate to see that happen, don't you, Josh? It does. It That looked a bit sus. Unfortunately, that's what happens in Broomball sometimes. So, you go go with the flow. But I do did talk to Beck after that, and she said she felt really bad. Kind of concussion feeling. So, we do hope she gets better. 
Uh, by the same token, I spoke to the other Beck who was on the other side, and there was no intention in it. It's just one of those things, slippery ice. Um, both back on the ice playing well since then, but obviously oh, a bit of an owies. As we get back to the action, there's a nice part, nice shot in from Ankara, and Mark clears it away to the side really quick. Hansen really pushing this attack. Oh, she wants a big win over Anka. It's a nice clear. Shan dropping back again. Reset, resets this team, team word. They have to work again. They're really working in their defensive side a lot, it seems. They seem to have a lot of one out, but not so much sustained pressure. Are you seeing the same thing, Josh? Yeah, it's a lot of counter attack at the moment. Hopefully that changes in the late part of this second half and they can get it. Try to get an equalizer. Anka passes it to Shan. It's Ashland's in the middle. Goal scoring opportunity. Back oh, Shan. Shan, Shan's working in. Unfortunately, it's a block. Oh, a little bit of a push and shove there by Shan. Shan wants this. She wants the equalizer. Uncle the club, the club broom board. It's not coming to effect at the moment. So nice flick in. Unfortunately, straight into the legs of an opposing player. And Joe with the clearance. This experience from Joe is really showing in this win of the game. She's really dominating the play. Uncle with a nice push through to Shan. You have the flick in again. She likes that flick, doesn't she, Joe? She's really working on her skills. It's and it's showing the confidence from going to Worlds and being in the women's one team last year in Nationals is really showing, so look, to, look forward to good things from her. Do we have another shot on? It's a pass out to Uncle and Uncle the slash. Unfortunately, it didn't go anywhere near. Joe with the runaway. This could be interesting. Oh! Ashlyn chasing her. She's not going to give her up easy. What's going to happen here? And a goalie save. That was a nice save. Unfortunately, deflection goes straight out to, I think it was Monique. He tried to run it back in. He's laying him back to Monique. And it's a block and it's a nice shot on target there. I do draw your attention back. I think when Beck came back onto the ice, I think it might have been a little bit of offside there, but I'm just not too sure. Maybe too close to call. I will go with the ref. We'll assume positive intent and say the ref's got it right. Over overall, it didn't affect the game, but as we go back, Tilly's really working hard for that ball. Yeah, she's been pushing pretty hard out there tonight, hasn't she? She has, Chris. Unfortunately, a block there by Joe. Joe works around Tilly. Well, it's Tries to get that push, gets that the flick over the top. Straight into the hands of, I think it's Larissa on the break now. It is. L but Sarah's not going to let her get away. Really making a nuisance of herself there, Sarah. Really some good defense. As we wait for the cameraman to show us where the ball is. Oh, it shows Dominic has got the ball. They're really working that pressure. Gets that pass into the corner for Larissa. Great guys from the Unfortunately, her handle, yes, she couldn't really work it there. I don't think you had her footing quite right. She seemed to be holding onto the boards to keep upright while she was swinging for that one, Josh. Sometimes you don't have your balance. You've got to work with what you have. Although she has the ball back, so this is positive thoughts for this team. Oh, is that a block? That's a block into the corner, guys. Chelsea first to it. Nice urgency there. That's an open shot. It's a flick over the top. Chelsea's got some space to work with here. She has three team, uh, three opposition what? players on her. <laughs> I don't think she's going to be able to get away with it this one. Jody with the hold up of the ball. Looks for an option. Really taking her time, really soaking up this time clock. Well, it's the advantage of being ahead, Josh, isn't it? When you're up ahead, you can afford to take your time. Yeah, you can afford to play with play play playing ahead instead of playing behind it gives you that little bit of relaxed nature it's deep in deep in that zone again this team woohoo is really working the attacking pressure really building really building the attacking pressure on team woo and it's starting to show as we find it in the corner it's just a little bit unsettled at the moment Langham with the ball. Langham's away, but again, Sarah, her, her teammate from Druid's B, just not letting her have any space. Yeah, it seems wherever it's Hellier seems to work, that's where the attack's pushing. So hopefully they can work that attack and go. Uh, Prime with the ball here. Slows it up a little bit behind, waits to see what she's got. Larissa getting down for that four check. Seems to really 
making it hard to work for a pass. Cody nice. with the cart, unfortunately, uh, Jody through. And again, Jody cleaning up the scraps. She, she doesn't seem to be running a lot tonight, but when she does, she seems to be in the perfect position to stop them. It's a nice car, oh, unfortunately, not a good pickup by Ashley. Uh, Dominique with the runaway, bit of space to work with. Oh, nice clearance there by Team Wu. Dominique in the corner. This battle again. Glacier versus Hellier seems to be a running battle between these two. It's a nice pass in the middle by Jody. Or two Jody. Oh, jo and is that in? Is no, it is blocked. It was a nice lay down save by Jared there, Chris. It was very well played. Hellier with the ball, trying to work it out of this corner. Just a little bit too much time on that. Uh, I like how she's closing off the options there. Is that uh, Larissa again closing those options off? Yeah, she is really she's really improved her four check. The experience from nationals last year really seems to have helped her game progress a little bit more. I'm starting to see a couple of tired legs out there, Josh. If you have a look, they're all slowing down a little bit, and there's only a couple of players still able to really push really fast down the ice. Uh, it seems to be just a just a matter of urgency at the moment. It's Team, team who is really showing their experience at the moment. Really setting up these plays, really being deliberate in how they do things. Nice, neat, slow passes, remember. Mm. Slow is smooth, smooth is fast. It's all short, sharp, and no, no real desperation in their play at the moment. It's a nice over. I think it was a good call by that ref. It was a close, close call, but I think it was the right call. Yeah, it, was, it was a beautiful switch to Ashley, who's away. That's a bit of space. A little bit of a hook in there by Dominique. But Anka following up, ready for this, ready to swipe that in if she gets a chance. And she turns Larissa inside out. Larissa just cannot stop with her. A little bit of a tussle on that boards. Save there by Mark. Jody picks up the scraps. Nice clearance off the boards, but Shan to it again. And Shan, unfortunately, puts it out, out of play. Now, as we get a reset of the clock, we're in the last six minutes of the second half. It's nice 1 0 score line. Do you think I'll just hold that for the rest of the game, or do you think you'll see some last minute desperations? I really think Team Woot, they're, they're working that counter attack really well, so I think they'll really push to try to get that equaliser, but they've probably got to have at least a minute or two of some attacking pressure to really work it around. Nice one by Joe. Joe seems to be all over on from the face-off dot. Uh, I think that just a little, little bit of a little bit of experience is starting to tell with that play. It's a nice clear into the back. Brown with the ball. Four check again by Larissa is really impressive. I think Larissa wants an extra goal. She wants to really drive home the nail there. She really wants to get, really wants to get that goal on video. You know, I've been talking to her lately, and she's, she's just disappointed that she, she's getting so close with the goals, but not really getting close enough. Such a small. She's got a couple of goals this season. Um, <laughs> Josh, but it just doesn't seem to be ones that we ever get in film. That too, uh, yeah. <laughs> really got to talk to this camera and he's like, just letting the team down. Nice pass from Monk, it's a Brown there. Brown in, no, not enough power behind it. I think it clipped the player on the way through. Uh, they must have, I think Joe's got the ball. She's got a bit of space to work with here. Ashton trying to block in that centre. Work back to the middle, Anka's there. Nice save by Jared. Back following up, you've got Monique on the on the goals as well so got two players on this pass in the center oh Shan's close that out and it's straight to Shan's shins this is Louise with the ball she's got a bit of, has a bit of space unfortunately couldn't find the connecting pass and I think that's what's let team work down today they've had a lot of attacking play just couldn't get that connecting pass well, as I was saying fluency. as I was saying it seems like a lot of one outmanship from um, from Team Woo, well, Team Woohoo seems to be the sustained pressure. Both having equal shots on goals, but just a little bit missing from the, the Team Woo attack. Nice clearance there by Team Team Woo. Team Woohoo works it back. In the last oh. couple of minutes. Oh. I think if Tilly had gone down, that would have been a send off. 
but Tilly's not giving up. She's fighting for that one. Yeah, and a little bit lucky there to avoid that call. Back over the line. Ashland couldn't get, unfortunately, couldn't get that ball to hold up a little bit. Four check is really good. Joe Hansen really working hard for that ball. Players coming through on the post. Again, you've got Beck and you've got Monique there heading straight into goals. Ooh, does Beck have the corner? No, a bit of pressure. She has that ball. She still has that ball. So we we'll, we'll work that pass around. Unfortunately, it doesn't get back to Jody. Sarah trying to work around Jody, but Jody really putting her presence involved, making it hard for Sarah to push through. Although, it does get through. Sarah with the ball, trying to push it to that center to Tilly. Fortunately, just a little bit too much time on that, Chris. Yeah, the ball just went behind Tilly on the attack on goals. Um, but it was a great idea. It was a perfect way to set up that pressure. Just that pass that second too late. But Shen, still with the ball, is still in control there. Mm. And they're starting to mount that pressure. Some late pressure here. Back into the post. I think that is Larissa. Larissa with the ball at the moment. Oh, no, no Larissa's up high. It was Dominique. Larissa was trying to give it a pass. Sorry, Dominique. Jody again with the swing around. She likes she likes really stretching out. She's got long arms and she likes to really take advantage of those mm. on the ice. It does work well for well for it, but when it doesn't, you know, it really ends up badly. But well, she seems to be lucky today. I mean, that's because someone falls over when it ends up badly for her. But it seems to be working out in her team in her favour today, so she'll take that any day of the week. Well, no broken collar bones tonight. True. really trying to soak up this time we are in the last couple of minutes maybe two or three minutes left to work back to Shan gets in that middle unfortunately Joe's there it works into that corner Larissa trying to chase after that ball the urgency is still there to push for that second goal put this game out, out in doubt Oh, stand up save. Oh, unfortunately, blocked through. And we have a goal there. Nice goal by the ladies. And that puts the game to 2-0. And I think that puts it out of, out of doubt. I think we've got less than a minute to go, Josh. So I think we'd really only get a reset and then that would pretty much be the end of it. Anka's really trying to push hard for this face-off. So the urgency's there. We get the face-off. It's a nice work by Brown, trying to get it down. Straight Gets through. Unfortunately, nobody really there to get to it. Finds that space. Tilly working hard to get to that ball. But I think Larissa's got the legs on her. I don't know. I think Tilly's got it. She's oh. working hard. Oh, she gets a nice pass through. I'm try desperately trying to get a ball to a teammate. Mark just stops it up, breaks it up there. Anka first to that ball. Shank grabs it. Can going to Shane have a shot before it finishes. It's a nice shot. Off that backboard, nice clear to the side by the goalie there. In that corner. Chan's going to take another swing. And again, that kind of sliding defense that just seems to be shutting them down every time. That's the game, Josh. That's good. And that's that's a 2-0 victory to Team WooHoo. Thank you for your time tonight, Josh. Thank you, Chris. We, we look forward to the next match.